Wisdom's Words of Wisdom from Wisconsin. And today's show is part good. Okay, part two for those who are not Francophiles, okay? I'm going to make peach jam, okay? So, I'm not going to use sterilized jars, okay? I, I washed them, but this isn't like, you know, with the tongs and the boiling water and all of that mm. jazz. I peeled and pitted three of these beautiful peaches. So I'm going to put them in a bowl with a lot of sugar. This is calling for two cups of fresh peaches for three cups of granulated sugar. And one who is not a minimalist, okay? More is more in my book, okay? But that's a lot. That's a lot of sugar. I'm gonna cut it in half. You can always add more sugar no. later. I put my peaches in here, cut them up, and then I dumped in I, I'm only going to use a cup of sugar, okay? And it says add the sugar to the bowl and stir well. Let it rest. No time for that. We're just going to plow on through. And then it says add a little sugar at a time with resting in between to help the sugar dissolve completely. We don't have time for disillusion. We don't have time for disillusion. So, all right, that's good enough. I think it's dissolved. See? And then it says... If it's still grainy from the sugar, don't proceed until the sugar has dissolved. I like grainy jam, okay? I like grainy jam, so we're not going to rest, okay? It says add the pectin. Pectin? I don't have pectin. What's pectin? Wait a minute. I got to go on the Google and see what I can use if I don't have pectin. Okay. I went on the Google. It says you can use... Unflavored gelatin, it's a thickening agent, or jello. Little lemon yellow. Okay, so hasn't expired yet. That's good. Well, it's a good thing I didn't add all that sugar because now I'm going to be adding some of this to it. And I'm just going to add a little, I don't know, like a tablespoon. We're winging it. We're just winging it. This is raw. This is real organic cooking. I don't have all of those little bowls, everything all pre-measured out and all sorts of cameras and all that jazz. This is real raw. This is Americana cooking at home, cooking with ML. This is cooking with ML. Add a little bit more. I'm going to add a little bit more because why not, okay? Because we don't have that pectin, whatever that is in this little pan right here. Bring it to a boil. And that should be it, I think. Now, let me get a clean spoon. Keep it sanitary. Now the peach jam, okay? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You know what? You can taste the lemon. So it's kind of lemon. It's like lemonade peach jam. You can put this on pancakes, French toast, toast. Just eat it. Ice cream. <gasps> you could put this on ice cream. Fantastic. I hope that you've enjoyed this little show. And it's given you some tips and ideas on how you too can make tomato jam, peach jam. And then watch my other show on how to make peach Jalapeno chutney. Okay, thanks for watching, everybody. Bye-bye. Wow.